have a problem, mm. everyone also is going through, through something. Mm. Like, even even if I call you like right now, since some yeah. people just don't want to help. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. <laughs> it's not necessarily that they're going through something, but they'll tell you, I'm just from the bank right now to I'm pay from, for my. I'm just from. You yeah. know, so at the end of the day. <laughs> You are there with your problem. It's you versus you, friend. No one is gonna help you. You are no. crying. <laughs> but also, don't be fake about it. Yes. Because some people, they want to cover their problems with how they look. Like, they just want to fake until you... Do you believe in fake it until you make it? Um, no. Put you in the mood. Really? Welcome to this house. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> hi guys welcome back to my channel if it's your first time here my name is Irene and today I have a very beautiful doll in life this is Shindia <laughs> guys sorry my name is Cynthia yes and she's a visitor here today we are yes. going to do this video together please just look at how gorgeous this girl pretty is. doesn't admit that she's pretty oh my god it's fine but yeah so what are we going to talk about today Ooh. you know do me the honors today we're gonna talk about lessons in our 20s yes we're gonna tell you guys all the tea yes today we have the tea Cynthia is very good with the teas so if it's green tea black Guys, let me tell you, I feel like, okay, one of the lessons that I learned in my 20s is to trust my intuitions. Guys, for now on, I'm gonna listen to my intuitions because I never listen and I always okay. read. I don't know. You know when you have that feeling that... Yeah, the gut feeling. Yes, you know it's not right, but you keep going, you keep doing that uh, and when things get pretty bad you're just like oh my god you have the i told you moment yes i told you i told you i told you <laughs> why did you keep up that is the first thing i'm gonna do for me i feel like it's forcing really yeah to put into that like listening to our intuition mm -hmm. i would say like sometimes we don't have to force things because you really see this is the wrong journey i'm taking you're seeing this is really this juice is orange but you're telling yourself this is a grape juice yes that's what most of the time we do so i feel like it's all wrong see? exactly yeah so you see it's written don't pass here and you want to pass there don't do that always listen to intuitions it like everything people situation everything guys when you feel that boys yes when you feel like there is something that is not right like the things Oh, yeah, pack and go. And leave. <laughs> okay. For me, something that I learned in my life or in my 20s about life is that things are seasonal. Yes. Yes. Things like being broke is seasonal. Oh, my gosh. Don't worry. Don't... <laughs> this will come. It doesn't mean we have a lot of money. It doesn't mean we have money at all. Yeah. But what I'm saying is that everything is seasonal. Like... Things can be seasonal. You can. You don't have a job. You don't have to worry about that. Time will come, exactly. and you get a job. And uh, let's say heartbreaks. Mm -hmm. They're just seasonal. Just live in that. You know. Sometimes there's beauty in the season. Yes. Yeah. The lessons. The beauty. Of course. That is actually what I want to say. But you can continue. <laughs> sure. No. 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 You're my visitor, so I give no, you that. No. I actually want to say that one thing that I learned about seasons mm -hmm. and situations is that life is not easy exactly there are times we're gonna be happy there are times we're gonna be sad mm -hmm. there are times we're gonna have everything and there are times that you're gonna have you know nothing yes the, the only thing that you need to oh you speak portuguese oh my god <laughs> nothing guys you're gonna have nothing the most important thing is you learn to live your best life while you're going through whatever situation Okay, it's happening in your life right now. That is the most important thing. If you're broke, learn to live your best life while you're broke. I know it's not easy, especially when things get hard. Mm. It's hard for you to see positive aspect about that situation. I don't know about you. It's really, uh, it's really hard. For me, it's not hard to see positive in, in, your, in your hard season. Yes. I, I don't know about you, but I always learn something new. I feel like my growth... Mm. And my changes in life and the person that I am right now, mm. it's because I was in a, 
yes hard season me too in so many you know we can say a hard season in relationships a hard season in finance a hard season in academics a hard season in everything yes. so all that in life is the is what made me today i'm grateful for my mother and the teachings that i get from the church and everything but the life that i lived myself the hard seasons really made me worry. yes that's why i think it's very important for us to live our best life while we are going through yeah enjoy thing. it yes enjoy yeah, i know if it's you're hard. broke you're losing weight it's exercising <laughs> which exercise is this go guys don't listen to her please feed yourself eat if that money doesn't solve the problems you have <laughs> eat that, that one, money yes but one thing that i want to tell you guys is that if you know you can't solve the problem right now why stressing about it uh exactly because when you stress it doesn't go away yes why it's stressing things. about it guys sometimes you really need to take a break think analyze the situation and come with a better plan hallelujah okay what's the other thing that you've learned let me see i think oh it actually has to do with what we say okay. right now guys please don't look like your problems <laughs> don't look like your problems it doesn't matter how broke you are don't look like your problems you know i don't know i really hate when people see me and they tell me are you fine I don't know about you guys. I really hate that. <laughs> don't look like your problems. Try to look your best self while you're going. I feel like uh, look good all the time. Yes. It doesn't matter what you're going through because the other day I went to church. Mm. It's I, did, I was not going through a hard time, but I was busy. Mm -hmm. And I woke up with this color here, this color here, this color here. My hair. I think I had like a a head a head wrap which was just crazy and mm -hmm. i looked at myself and i'm like am i really here to worship god looking like this yes. and how about the people that are seeing me so don't look like your people situations people don't really need to know what's going on in your life yes people don't really to, need to know if you don't want to if you don't want them to know then why looking like your problems you know that is one thing that i actually learned last year mm -hmm never to look like my problem it doesn't matter if i'm broke if i'm bank account is if i'm having health problems but also don't be fake about it yes because some people they want to cover their problems with how they look like they just want to fake until you do you believe in fake it until you make it um not really do you no <laughs> why am i faking exactly uh I really don't understand. Okay, you know the people that we live in that they will cancel us. But one thing that I want you to know is that don't look like your problems. Even if you're facing financial problems, try to look your best self. Okay? People don't need to look at you and associate like, oh, she's going through this, she's going through that. There are some people that they look like their life is perfect. They look like they get they got their I don't wanna swear. You know, do not swear in this house. Okay, they look like everything is put together. It's going well. Yes, you just look at them and you're like, oh my gosh, this girl, this guy, look at him, look at her. She looks, you know, <laughs> guys. She looks her together. I'm not saying that you should pretend or you should like ignore your problems while you're solving your problems. You should look your best self. I feel like actually when you look your best self when you're going through things, mm. it even motivates you. Yes. It gives you the peace of mind. Imagine having problems and then. You are, you're stressed and now you're looking ugly and a person is asking you what's going on you that know it's adding stress over stress so at least yes wake up and shower oh my gosh that is too deep no i mean <laughs> shower to me taking a taking a shower to me it means taking care of yourself just oh, take care of yourself you. have your nails done exactly your hair you don't have to do it yeah, you don't need Extra. to do. Yes, you don't need to do. Like, take care of yourself. Yes. We all have different ways to take care. I mean, of yourself, do we right? look like our problems? I don't know. So for me, another lesson that I learned in life is to educate myself. Ooh. Always educate yourself. Like, especially when you're a girl. I don't know about men. I think like men can use their strength, mm -hmm. and women have other things they can use. It's your choice. But I feel like to be on the safe side of this life, just. Educate yourself. You don't necessarily need the degree. There mm -hmm. are so many free 
I content that mm-hmm. teach things. Yes, I don't finance. That is actually what I wanna say. I don't think nowadays you really need to get a degree to get to cater. She's a liar. She's doing her masters, guys. <laughs> I'm doing my masters, but I know you. You don't really. <laughs> okay, guys, you do what? Yeah, but what you're saying is true. I feel like yes, the degree is not. It's not some. I mean, with okay. all the education we are. In front of cameras. Oh my gosh, guys! I learned the editing and recording videos. So educate yourself, like like in every aspect of your life. Try to educate yourself financially. Mm-hmm. On well, saving. Yeah, saving is very important. Yeah. I feel like I don't know about you, but mm-hmm. I have been in situations if I didn't save money. Oh my god! Who hasn't? By now. Let's talk about the lockdowns. Oh my gosh, the lockdown. Yeah, if you didn't have savings. How would you have survived? I don't Even know. a tiny bit of it, like how would you have survived? At least these second, I mean second, third, fifth, we have had so many lockdowns in here. Let's yeah. talk about the first one. The first one, I feel like I, I was, you know, what is that zom- that zombie <laughs> series? <laughs> Walking <laughs> Dead. Yes. <laughs> hey guys, the flames. I was like, what is this? I don't even watch that series. My cousin loves it. <laughs> Me too. I know people that watch it. But it was really hard, guys. It was hard. Everything yeah. was closed. I was just like, am I going to survive this? Exactly. <laughs> well, so, we months. lived on savings. Yes. Yeah, save we lived on your savings. Money. Don't spend everything. I don't believe we should suffer. You should enjoy your money. Mm-hmm. Okay, you should enjoy life, but make sure that you're gonna save something when hard times come. Or you can also invest, you know? Yeah, if you can. Yes, guys, learn to invest, learn to save money. Don't spend if you don't need to. Okay, be responsible because you don't, you never know what is gonna happen tomorrow. True. You never know, then only God knows. So, and this t- place has taught me that you do not know about tomorrow. Yes. Yeah, you I've never learned know. it. So, save your money. For emergency as well, mm-hmm. because sometimes, guys, I don't know about you, but I have been in emergency situation. If I didn't save my money, because hmm. <laughs> you're calling everyone for help, nobody's helping out. Do you know when you have a problem, mm-hmm. everyone also is going through, through something. Mm-hmm. Like even even if I call you like right now, since some yeah. people just don't want to help. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. <laughs> it's not necessarily that they're going through something, but they'll tell you, I'm just from the bank right now to I'm pay from... for my I'm just from you know, so at the end of the day <laughs> You are there with your problem. It's you versus you friend. No one is gonna help you, you are no. crying. <laughs> Don't fool yourself with ya. Yeah. You live once. Yes, you live once, but yes, live once. Problems come <laughs> once as well. So save the money, friends. Save the money. Mm-hmm. Educate yourself in every aspect of your life, academically, financially, yeah, emotional. in so many yes. things, spiritually as well, guys. Take your spiritual life serious. I don't know about you, but take it serious. I don't know what you believe. I believe in God. It's my number one. Yes, but take your life serious. Yeah. Always educate yourself, especially for us ladies i think it's very important exactly even if you're pretty you need to add something or bring something to the table not just the looks looks (laughs) Looks won't pay bills yes looks won't pay bills it talks about what you say and how you look Mm -hmm. until you open your mouth that's when your mouth is going to determine like what kind of a person because you know some people like they are so bomb and fine but when they speak you're like, oh my god, what's going on? So, right. have both if you can. Yes, guys, I feel like it's very important. Exactly, it's very and important. That's period. So guys, another thing that I, that I learned in my 20s is that not everyone deserves to have access to you. Oh? Not everyone deserves to have, not everyone deserves to know your business. Protect your peace, please. Protect your peace, God. I don't know what you... I just feel like it's very important for us to protect I feel like our peace. have boundaries. Yes. Have know boundaries. when it's enough and know mm-hmm. when to... <laughs> I don't when to cut... To shut your mouth. Yes. Don't say everything. Like, don't put yes. everything out there to everyone. It's not like... It's not necessarily that they're gossipers. Do you believe in, in dark energy? I do. Like... There are those people that you can Energy tell them some and vibes. Like when I feel like the vibe is not vibing, I'm sorry, but I'm. 
Yeah, but that's true again. It's also true. But there are those people that. that they have like a spirit of killing. I feel like they the how do I say? You can for instance you tell me that I want to start this business mm. and then I ask I start telling you it will never work out. Really? I know somebody who did it and it failed. I know somebody who tried it and it never went like this. Mm -hmm. I feel like they already have that mindset and just just keep some of the things to yourself. Yes, keep it's not it safe of, out there. I just feel like a lot of things we should just keep to ourselves. People don't need to know. Yeah, and not everybody deserves to have access to you. Exactly. And it's okay to be selective mm -hmm. and to know who you want to be part of your life and who you don't. <laughs> But how can you have everyone? Huh? Do you believe in having everyone in your life? No, I don't know. I personally like a peaceful life. Yeah. You know, I don't like stress. And I just feel like I don't even have fr time for my friends. I do, mm -hmm. but I just feel like I don't have enough time for a lot of things. Imagine having a lot of people in my life. I just feel like it's causing yourself unnecessary stress and problem. It's true. Like, I especially don't know. in this country, we don't have that time. I don't know. Time like, moves I really know there fast. are people that can manage good for you i yeah. personally can't guys yeah i can't manage if you can't keep up if you if you can't try to minimize yes minimize that it's unnecessary very unnecessary guys so for me the last thing that i can say from me is like have something going on in your life anything going on in your life like especially what? if you're a woman like, like a job Ooh. or go to school like something going on in your life Yes. It's not like that's just a matter of people seeing you like it gives you respect or something mm -hmm. But it's even good for yourself because if you have something going on you're going to make your brains work Yes, you're going to be productive imagine if you have nothing going on What time are you going to wake up like what for instance when it's lockdown? We have nothing going on here Yes. So you ask yourself. Why am I waking up? Where am I going? You see no, so at the beginning it was great <laughs> yeah, I know. That's what I'm yes. saying. When it became a lifestyle, like we have nothing going on. So that's why you should always have something going on. First, to keep yourself active and your brain working. Mm -hmm. You have something that you can think of. Sometimes solving problems is really nice. I just feel like it will also help you to grow. Exactly. That's what I'm saying. Yes. It's really nice. If you, I just feel like if you don't have anything going on in your life, then why do you... Let <laughs> me not say that. No, 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 it's fine. I don't want to say, why are you waking up? <laughs> no, no, I'll tell you, that's right. Because there was t one time when I was in school, they stole my pocket money, like really? all of the money. Oh yes, God. they stole my wallet. Huh. And then the next morning, when the bell rang to wake up, I told myself, you don't have money, where are you going? Really? Like, why do you, why do you have to wake up? So, if I feel like if I was at home, that day I was not going to class. I would have stayed inside the dorm or inside the room the entire day. Like, where am I going? Yes, I feel like you don't really need to do the most, but just have something going on. Yeah. In your life. Keep yourself busy. Keep yourself busy, especially if you're in your 20s. Whatever you want to accomplish, even if, it doesn't matter how hard it is, try to do something. It doesn't matter how small it is. As and you don't have to work out. Yes, as long as you're doing something that is the most and do it right, please. Okay, <laughs> do it right. One thing that I really need to start to do is not, you know, work smart. Please talk more about that because I feel like work smart. Don't be there frustrating yourself and doing the most just work hard this year and this year not so oh, don't work hard work smart that is what i want to tell you yeah. guys okay work hard this well. year oh. i want to work smart hard yes you get it i don't yes. want to you know they say don't work hard work smart i feel like i want to work smart hard i get it like i want to have that peace as long as things are going on in my life but there's a me that I want to preserve. There's a me that don't kill yourself. And then even if they fail, it's a chance to learn. We did things and they failed and then we keep going. You're learning. Like, it's don't do that failure. again. As long as you are. Yeah, it's, you say it right. If it's not, trying, it's never a failure. Just have something going on in your life, guys. Keep yourself busy, please. You know, you can't be available. You can't be available 24-7 every day. You have, what is, hey. 
<laughs> you know, we have a meme like in my in my in our language. It's like when when you have nothing going on in your life. I mean, at home. Mm. For instance, you're still in school, mm -hmm. and then you're no longer studying. Mm -hmm. You don't have a job. You're not studying. You're not married. Okay, for some people, marriage is not really important. But continue. yes, okay. and for some people, it's something going on in your life, which I agree. It's not easy being married. Oh, oh. are you married? No, but we see yeah. married people. It's not an easy thing. Today, I, I asked myself. I mean, I asked my my friend at church uh. about. She has two children. Wow. Yeah, very cute. I told her it must be great. She said, "Uh huh, it's hard work." <laughs> so what I'm trying to say is that when the parents come back from work, whenever they come back from home, and they find you on the couch, just on your phone or just on the TV, you're just eating free food, and you're now like 25. You're my age, 27. Like, really? No, it's not good. Like. For instance, you're a man and you have nothing going on in your life. How do you feel? Because myself as a woman, when sometimes I have nothing going on in my life, whether by choice or not, there's this kind of a way I feel. You know, I feel like something is lacking in my life. Yes. Because when you have something going on in your life... That is the motivation for you to yes, wake up. Yes, and then. also you have control of your life. Yes. You have... Like, you know that I have this, I have that. I believe in being independent as a woman me too and that's on pure <laughs> exactly call it anyhow but i believe in being independent as a woman and how can i be independent something must be going on in my life the last thing that i want to tell you all is to learn to choose your friends wisely please know who are you <laughs> Who are your friends? Yeah. No, but guys, it's very important, especially if you're in your 20s. You need to have people around you that will inspire you to be a better person. Yes. People that will motivate you. You know, sometimes you go through hard moments in life. I don't know about you, but I have been in situations that my family don't even know about it. And my friends really help me to get out of that situation. Exactly. The more you grow, the more your family expects you to solve your stuff on your own. Yes. The more independent they expect you to be. So yes. I can't go back. Oh, and other things, not everything you can share with your you, with your family. Yeah, there's certain things yeah. that I don't know about you, but mm -hmm. I just feel like there's certain things you can't share with your family. Exactly. So, choosing your friend, having great friends is very important. Not only friends, true friends. You Quality. Know, people that you can really count on. Because sometimes quantity is not... When it comes to friendship. Uh, but I, don't, I just feel like these people can really help us mm -hmm. to grow and to become a better person as well and on top of that imagine you're not doing anything with your life your friends are also hey <laughs> the true. tea guys i'm not here trying to tell you, know you that, that i'm perfect my life is perfect everything i try yes we all try we all try we all try at the end of the day you know one of the best advice my dad ever gave me is that it's your life mm -hmm. if you don't do what is necessary for you to achieve whatever you want or to have, you know, a stable life. Nobody's gonna do it for you. Yes, because my dad always told me his life is already sorted. He's living his life. So it's yours. So Which guys, is true though. Uh, so it's guys, true. be careful who you consider as a friend. We have snake friends. We have friends that just wanna take advantage of us. Those That's who true. don't really take advantage of us, but we also don't get anything from them. So be careful. So guys, that's the end of this video. And until yes. next time, thank you so much for watching. Please do not forget to subscribe on Cynthia's channel. I'm going to link it here. Please check it out and subscribe. She has great and amazing videos. And if you want to see us do a video together again, let us know, right? In the comment section. Please. Yes. And tell us what you want us to talk about. What do you want to see us doing? <laughs> Thank you so much. I'm going to leave our social media handles. Follow us on Instagram and Snapchat. Do you use Snapchat? No. Me too. I don't use Snapchat either. Just follow us on Instagram. Yeah, just Instagram. And just subscribe on these channels and watch yes. all the videos, okay? Yes, because she does. Look at this face. Look at this. Look at this face. Oh, look at her. Guys, <laughs> the face is serving. It's giving. Oh my god, this video is really everything. But see you on my next video and until next time. Bye bye. Bye bye.